I'm Dr. Chalmers, and people have been asking a lot about clay packing and exactly what it is and why we do it. So, the first thing to understand is that there are three communication systems in the body. The first one is the bioelectrical or the nervous system. The other one is the biochemical or the hormone system. And the third is the photooptic. This is the meridian system. So most people are going to understand this system better through like acupuncture than anything else. That communication system can become damaged from anything from piercings, punctures, uh, blunt force trauma, surgical interventions, anything like that. So if you've had <clears throat> uh, spinal tap, vaccines, and stepped on a nail, those are good punctures. Um, if you've had a belly button piercing, if you've had uh, any other body piercings, those are good examples of piercings. If you've had appendix out, gallbladder out, if you've had plastic surgery, any type of surgery, uh, those are good examples of obviously surgery. So when those meridian lines are damaged, what we have to do is we have to reconnect them to the central node or central command centers. Central command centers run down the center of the body, right? But basically down the spine. So what we're going to end up doing is repairing site to the site on the body and kind of reconnecting for communication purposes. It substantially decreases the amount of nutrients the person has to take and allows people to heal a lot faster. That's why we do this. Uh, so doing this is going to help us to s speed up what we're normally doing and in a lot of ways it'll help us to do things that could never have been done before. It works a lot better in children than it does in adults but it's something that everybody has to do. So on the website we're going to put a list of common sites. Uh, for instance vaccines in the thighs always go to the stomach. Uh, epidurals almost always go to the stomach, belly button piercings, almost always go to the stomach. So things like that. So we'll kind of put a list on the website at chalmerswellness.com. Uh, you guys can find those mud sites there. Uh, and then I have a mud site video of actually how to make them up. Uh, if you guys have any other questions, feel free to give us a call.